It's a simple process to create a web view card from the media library. Simply choose the template and you can begin configuring. The first thing to do is to choose the website that you wish to display. You'll notice that there's no need to add the HTTP or HTTPS to it, as AppSpace will attempt both automatically. Once selected, you have multiple ways of embedding the website. In this case, let's use XHR Proxy, which is simply a way to bypass some browser security settings so we can display certain websites that do not allow embedding. Next, we'd perhaps like to do a bit of scaling in order to display a specific area of the website. We can choose a custom size with cropping to do so. By filling out the resolution desired, and also the coordinates for the area we want, remember that the top left corner is our frame of reference, we can adjust the region until we get the zoom we're looking for. Other customization options allow for the disabling of interactivity on the web page, and whether or not it loads gradually or only displays once fully loaded. You may also add a color to the background, which will only show if the website has a transparent background or the media zone where you use the card does not match the aspect ratio declared for the website section. Once we're happy that it's showing what we want, we can add some information to it, a custom thumbnail, and be ready to share that content.